Welcome to the first in a series of videos. Uh, well, it's the first in two series of videos. Uh, I plan on going through the uh, Mega Man X collection for the PlayStation 4, and this will be the first video in that series, as well as the first video uh, for the Mega Man X game, the first one um, originally for the Super Nintendo. So, I've been playing this since the Super Nintendo, and uh, I've played many different versions of this. Um, so, uh, first thing, uh, just as sort of a uh, great tip about the mechanics here, is uh, to always uh, switch the dash to the trigger. Uh, trigger is much easier to get to than trying to charge up and jump at the same time, which you kind of want to be able to do. Um, and then uh, the select R, you can move that from the circle, I guess, if you want. Uh, just if you find yourself hitting it a bunch, uh, you can switch it to one of the other trigger buttons or something out of the way. Uh, um, so yeah, I've been playing this since the Super Nintendo days, a bunch of different versions, and uh, sort of the purpose behind doing this with the Legacy Collection is to uh, show how awful it is. Like, I actually have another uh, uh, collection for the PlayStation 2, as well as uh, being able to run it on my Raspberry Pi. Um, and yeah, the, the biggest difference will be in Mega Man X3. But uh, I'll explain that when we get there. Uh, so also while I'm going through this, I'm going to try and uh, teach everybody how to play the game. So for everybody familiar with the uh, series here, just kind of wait till I start moving forward. Uh, if you find yourself being bored with the tutorial here. So there's a couple of different things you got to know about shooting. Uh, so there's you know the regular shot. You can also do the charge shot by uh, holding the button down. Um, and then uh, in all the other games, you start out with a dash. In this one, you don't. So the dash will be the first uh, armor upgrade you pick up here. And then, yeah, with these things, you always want to make sure you get them above the spiky thing, because the spiky thing is destroyed separately. And those guys have a couple of different attacks. There's the electrical attack, and then there's the missile attack. You just gotta kind of jump out of the way. So, like that. Okay, first mini boss here. So always be sure to charge up so that you can get the first shot. And, uh, what you see me doing is kind of charging while I jump. Uh, that's kind of easier to do in rapid succession. Just dodging. Uh, and yeah, there's a couple of life upgrades down there. Uh, I didn't really need them. That's where they are. Of course, now I need them. When they're not going to be there. Alright, so something I definitely uh, want to point out first is uh, the music that you hear is uh, actually one of the things that I find I like about the Legacy Collection, at least the Super Nintendo side of it, is uh, they actually use uh, sounds that sound like the uh, Super Nintendo sound effects. Because, yeah, back in the day, uh, before you, you know, released actual audio recordings of your sound effects, there was uh, sound hardware built into the individual consoles, and sound programmers had to figure out how to make the sounds that they're going for with the chips that are in the system. Kind of, uh, beginnings of our, where chip tune comes from. Yeah, always, always watch out for those car guys. They don't hit you pretty good if you're not paying attention. Uh, and so, yeah, I just like bringing this guy all the way to the end. Uh, you don't have to. But, uh, yeah, as soon as you destroy a couple of these cars, it's wild. And then, yeah, 
careful because you can sometimes drop them off the side of the screen. Yeah, just, I, it, this is my least favorite thing in every single video game, are the boss fights that you can't win. So yeah, just let him hit you till he traps you. I don't like walking all the way to the other side of the street. Just let him hit you. And then yeah, he'll eventually shoot the force field thing and hold you in place. Cutscene for the first appearance of Zero! So that's, that's actually my favorite part about the X Games, is yeah, you, you're kind of weak, you start out with the low health bar, but you get to collect armor and heart upgrades and, I don't know, that's, it, it was, it's very rewarding when a game gets easier as you play it, um, which is kind of one of the annoying uh, things that they do with this series is, oh, when things start getting easier, you just start adding instant kill spikes everywhere. Alright, so password, save, and everything else. Um, Alright, so welcome to the video series on both Mega Man X and uh, the Mega Man X Legacy Collection for the PlayStation 4.